hey guys welcome back to another video and in this video we're going to see how we can set our shortcuts for the tools in maya so last time we created this shelf and uh, today let's use this and uh, i'm going to take this cube and if you want to extrude a part of this cube for example let's extrude this face uh, we can either go to uh, edit mesh and uh, click on this extrude or what we can do is we can press ctrl e and it gives us the same option and now we can extrude it so today we are going to see how we can create our own shortcuts for the tools in maya so for that we have to go to windows and in the settings let's click on this hotkey editor and it's going to open this window here so you can uh, go and uh, click here in the menu items and it's going to show you all the items you have in these menus so for example if you want to go here in the modeling and in the mesh so we have this uh, shortcut for combine which is alt shift m and we don't have a shortcut for separate so if you click here and you press alt shift and when you're pressing alt and shift it's going to show you which keys are already assigned so with alt shift uh, these a s d t v m and these keys are already assigned so you can't assign them you have to override them and uh, you can choose any of these keys so for the separate i'm going to choose alt shift and p so just press alt shift and p and it's going to assign this hotkey for this uh, separate and you can uh, click on this save and the same for this smooth or any of these tools so for suppose i'm going to go here and uh, for smooth i'm going to press alt shift and let's see which key we can assign for this so S is already assigned, so I'm going to go with the H. So I'm pressing Alt Shift and press H, and it's going to assign this shortcut for this smooth and save. So you can use all these shortcuts and assign them in any of these tools and just save. So let's close this and uh, let's use our shortcut so we used alt shift and h for smooth let's see if it works so press alt shift and h and now we can smooth this object without going to go here in the mesh and selecting this smooth so that's how you can create your own custom hotkeys in maya so i hope you enjoyed this video and i'll see you in the next one